The first thing to do to play this UNO warm-up game is you're going to need to make a copy of the Google Slides. Once you've made a copy, look for this Play UNO menu up here next to the Help menu. You're going to have to authorize it. It collects no user data. You've made a copy. You're the owner. It's just going to allow you to run my code. So what you're going to see is that I have a stack of UNO cards and they're in a random order and they're placed along the bottom here. Now if you go back to that menu option, you have some choices. So when I go play UNO, I have the option to place five. That's going to clean up all my messy cards and it's going to place five cards. My screen is too small when I'm in this view. So each card links to a specific slide. So you can see that it's going to jump here in this case to slide 39. Can return back to the back. This one goes to slide 13 and this home button down in the corner links me right back. So you can then use, so we use the menu option to place five new cards that reshuffles it, cleans it up. You can also come to the menu and go to additional options. Let me slide this over so you can actually see it and I go to additional options, you can just randomize the cards. So now the cards are gonna be randomized, but just within this deck over here. They're not gonna randomize down at the bottom. And you can just gather all the cards up into one place. So you can then choose to place five new ones. Now this template, basically what it is, is just a bunch of images that link to unique slides. So what you're gonna do is on each of the slides put a question or a task or something for students to do and then how you want to use these options is up to you. If you do pick a card it chooses a random card so it's a green draw two so out of these I would need to have a green or a two which I have none of those so lose a turn draw a card I'm gonna play Uno I'm gonna place five new ones and then I can play Uno and pick a card. This is going to pop up with a card choice. Come on. Pick a card, right? So I blew seven. Okay, so there's no seven down here, but I do have a blue eight. So I'm going to go to slide 33, and there would be a question on there or a task for the student to do, and then return home. So one last thing that you want to do is you want to make sure you go to the view menu and where it says show film strip you want to turn that off right so now I can't see the side anymore so that when students choose a card go to slide 50 they can't see the other questions so they would return back to slide one it's a little tricky here when I'm trying to do this on a small screen and whoop, that's weird and then I'm able to use the menu options however you design your game.